Excrement in Council Vision Press Production News Media On December 18, 2023, Colport Borough Council had the smell of excrement as the pseudo-secretary blasted a public official. The pseudo-secretary was spreading the excrement all over the chamber's special meeting. Public comments by the emeritus president Joseph D. Nevling, he voiced in regard the pseudo-secretary, your mouth is moving but you say nothing, watching the 2 hour and 22 minutes video of the Colport Borough Council meeting will be a breaking wind experience. Vision Press Production is working on the presentation for you. Look forward in the video of December 18, 2003 to hear the pseudo-secretary spewing out verbal excrement twice in the meeting. Vision Press Production believes it demonstrated immaturity and could be considered grounds for dismissal from her role with council. Councillor Nart Ellie, in the meeting, who has a difficult time of handling the truth, exclaimed that the tax officer was a liar in regard to the Glendale Volunteer Fire Department, GVFD. If you go back in the history of Vision Press production videos when the Honorable Jack D. Lang attended meetings, Mr. Lang heard council state, that, official Colport Borough Council is ceasing and breaching the duly enacted contract with the Glendale Volunteer Fire Department. Referring to a comment in the Urbona Borough Council meeting, Councillor Nartelli stated the tax officer is a liar and is making the borough look bad, Councillor Nartelli stated we have a contract with the GVFD. You will hear the pseudo-secretary speak up and say we have no contract with GVFD. Who is the liar? At the first Thursday of the month of December, Irvona Borough Council enacted a contract with the Irvona Fire Department in the last meeting of the month on the first Thursday of each month, the council is faithful to meet on a regular basis, so that, the citizens know when the meeting are held for the business of Ravona Borough. The tax officer, at the meeting, commended the council for supporting the fire department. The full meeting is at http colon slash slash www.wkeys.com Click on the words, Ravona Borough Council videos The Ravona Council never use excrement words in their meetings. In the December 18 meeting, entities of the 961 Forest Street Glendale School District owned building were summoned to appear at the meeting. The only entity appearing was the church run preschool group. Finally, the borough council is waking up to the fact, the 961 Forest Street Glendale School District owned building is financially unsustainable. Approximately $9,000 in default. What is council's remedy, taxpayer will have to pay more, maybe 35 mils of taxation increase. Vision Press Production has been suggesting that the Glendale School District owned building should be returned to the school district. The building, in the opinion of Vision Press Production, should be given back to the school district or in the alternative, council should give the building to the four entities to manage and take care of the building's needs. The council is considering spending taxpayer money to refurbish the 961 Forest Street Glendale School District owned building for a cost of over $250,000. If the council would return the 961 Forest Street Glendale School District owned building to the school district, council could and should invest $250.000.00 in a new building making a three bay and fourth bay an office for the borough. Grant funding for a new building exclusively used for the borough equipment and office would be, in years ahead, more workable and stop the thought of raising taxes upon the taxpayers. As the President of Council stated, we were hoping the four entities would start paying more for the building. Appears the only entity paying rent is the preschool group, who stated in the meeting they will try to pay more. Please donate toilet paper to the borough to clean up the excrement strewn all over the council chamber by the pseudo-secretary or should we request soap? The Colport Borough Council special meeting video will be online in a few days. Thank you for watching the videos produced by Vision Press Production News Media. Respectfully.
Vision Press Production